Hello, so I'm going to show you how to combine two similar photos together using Affinity Photo. So right here I have this picture that I want to put into this picture because of the ring, it's very visible. So I want to have the feet move over to this photo right here. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this picture and I'm going to Command C to copy it. And then I'm just going to command V to paste it onto this file. So now it's on here and um, I'm going to just deselect that for now. So this is our picture which we're going to put the feet in. So I'm going to deselect this picture for now and select the one I copied over. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is use the selection brush tool. And I'm just going to select and make my brush bigger and I'm going to start selecting the section that I want to get rid of okay so that looks good and now to get rid of this you're just gonna click delete on your keyboard so now just click command D to deselect that and we're going to turn back on the other picture on here. So we're going to put it back on. All right. So now the pictures are together. But obviously you can see the line between where both of them cut. So before we can get rid of that line, we have to merge these two layers together. So you just click Shift and click the other layer. And they're both clicked at the same time. So now I'm just going to um, right click to merge them. So I'm going to click on Merge Visible. All right, and they created a layer which where the pictures are now combined. So now I'm going to use the Blemish Removal tool. And I'm going to zoom in to show you. So I'm just going to start clicking and you see the lines start disappearing and I'm just going to keep doing it. All right, so here we go. So now we have this picture right here where they're now combined. And um, it really doesn't look bad in my point of view. People are not really going to notice. Like I showed some of my friends and they really didn't notice that I had these two pictures combined together. So. Um, this is it, so I hope you find this video very helpful, and thank you so much for watching.